Hi, welcome to today's session on protecting your web applications and APIs. Thank you for joining us. My name is Emil Kiner, and I'm the product manager for Cloud Armor, the Google Cloud DDoS mitigation service and web application firewall, which is a key component of the WAP solution. I'm joined today by Mo Sala from ATB Financial, and I'll hand it over to Mo to introduce himself. Hi, I'm Mo Sala. I'm the director of cloud architecture for ATB Financial. And what I do is I help our team to understand how to best utilize the GCP infrastructure and its security products to align with the overall security objectives of our organization. Thanks, Mose. In today's talk, we will first go through an overview of Google's web app and API protection solution. Next, we'll touch upon the three core components of our end-to-end -end web solution consisting of Cloud Armor, Recaptcha Enterprise, and Apogee. After that, we'll tell you about our latest announcements, which is a deep integration of Cloud Armor and Recaptcha Enterprise at the edge of Google's network. And finally, we will do a deep dive on ATB Financial's use case for and perspective on partnering with Google to protect their mission critical applications. Web App and API Protection, or WAP for short, has emerged as a solution space in response to increasingly complex and diversified application architectures and delivery pipelines as well as to defend against an evolving threat landscape that is growing increasingly sophisticated with convergence in attack types and intents at the application level. Google's WAP offering provides comprehensive protection for your applications and APIs from DDoS attacks, bot-related threats, and as well as application security vulnerabilities, whether they are deployed on Google Cloud, on your premises, or with another infrastructure provider. The development, composition, and deployment location of web apps have fundamentally changed in the modern enterprise. The shift to microservices-based architectures has helped facilitate this transition and created more flexibility relative to location to ensure resources are hosted wherever the needs of the application or business dictate. At the same time, the threat landscape web applications face is more varied and dynamic than ever. Attackers still seek to exploit traditional application vulnerabilities through code and av uh, availability-based attacks, while also expanding their methods to target the connective tissue of modern web applications, APIs. Unfortunately, the sprawl of these endpoints can make it difficult to maintain the proper security controls. Misconfigurations, poor identity controls, and limited visibility can be exploited by attackers to improperly escalate privileges, access sensitive data, or launch fraudulent account takeover attacks via insecure APIs. What we are seeing is customers have taken a siloed approach to protection by purchasing point solutions for different types of attacks. These might also be managed by different teams and not work well together. This can lead to gaps in protection and increased acquisition and operation costs. Google is uniquely positioned to provide the same breadth of protection by leveraging three of our existing products, Cloud Armor for DDoS and web app defense, Recaptcha Enterprise for bot defense, and Apogee Hybrid for API defense. Cloud Armor, deployed at the edge of Google's network, is built using the same infrastructure, both hardware and software, that we originally developed to protect Google services like Search, Maps, and Workspace. We're flexible, providing options to integrate with our customers' existing security tooling in Google Cloud, on-prem, and in multi-cloud infrastructures. With Google's WAP solution, customers are able to ha have a single vendor that provides support and protection against modern internet threats with products that work well together. Cloud Armor is Google Cloud's DDoS protection service and web application firewall. It provides global scale defense against volumetric protocol and application level attacks offering the same protection for hybrid and multi-cloud workloads as it does for ones deployed on GCP. And it's built using the same technology and infrastructure that we originally developed to protect our own billion user properties, such as Search, Gmail, and Maps. Cloud Armor reflects our vision of bringing to bear Google's global scale to protecting workloads wherever they are deployed. All of our edge infrastructure, including Cloud Armor, load balancing, and CDN can be deployed in front of your websites or services, whether you are running in Google Cloud on-prem or with another provider. With Cloud Armor, customers are able to protect their applications from DDoS attacks, filter incoming requests by a geography, or most L7 parameters like request headers or cookies. Moreover, as a web application firewall, Cloud Armor contains pre-configured WAF rules to prevent against the most common attacks and vulnerability exploit attempts. Users have access to real-time telemetry containing Cloud Armor's decisions on a per-request basis, 
as well as a monitoring dashboard that gives granular views of allowed traffic and denied. ReCAPTCHA Enterprise is our fraud and bot protection product. Based on technology that has helped defend websites for over a decade from bots, ReCAPTCHA Enterprise allows you to leverage the insight and intelligence derived from protecting millions of sites on the web. ReCAPTCHA Enterprise offers unique capabilities built specifically for the enterprise to protect from bots and fraud. Security teams benefit from enhanced detection, such as extra granular scores, reason codes for high risk scores, and the ability to tune the risk analysis engine to your site's specific needs. In addition to the puzzles or manual challenges that you may be familiar with, it also supports a frictionless experience that doesn't disturb your end user through client-side instrumentation in the form of drop-in JavaScript libraries or a mobile SDK. And then the system provides risk scores allowing for progressive action. For example, depending on the risk score, an incoming request can trigger a requirement for a second factor, be outright blocked or redirected, or ultimately allowed through. As with our other solutions, it provides rich telemetry around interactions, scores, and actions. Apigee is our API platform that provides a single point of management for APIs through the entire lifecycle from both a development and operations perspective. The platform inspects API requests to protect, scale, adapt, control, and monitor API traffic. Apigee's out-of-the-box policies enable developers to augment APIs with features to control traffic enhance performance and enforce security without requiring them to write any code or modify any backend services. Building security around an API takes time and significant expertise, but Apigee can provide this to any API in minutes. Security policies let developers control access to APIs with OAuth, API key validation, and other threat protection capabilities. API Apigee provides for a positive security model, understanding the structures of API requests so it can more accurately determine valid and invalid requests. As part of the overall WAP solution, we're proud to announce the preview release of Cloud Armor bot management with a deep integration with ReCAPTCHA Enterprise. While customers can already use these products together, we wanted to simplify the deployment process and provide a more integrated and scalable experience. ReCAPTCHA Enterprise provides a world-class bot detection mechanism developed and continuously learning from a globally distributed multi-million website install base. With this deep integration, Cloud Armor users can now leverage ReCAPTCHA to detect and block bot traffic within their Cloud Armor security policies. All of this occurs at the edge of Google's network, far upstream of your protected workloads, allowing us to leverage the global scale of our network to mitigate bot threats without impacting the performance of your applications. Critically, with the integrated solution, Cloud Armor and ReCAPTCHA Enterprise can protect customer applications without requiring server-side changes on the application to decipher and enforce bot assessments. In addition to the ReCAPTCHA integration, Cloud Armor Bot Management introduces an enhanced set of capabilities designed to help you deploy an effective bot management strategy. These capabilities include additional rule actions to redirect traffic, as well as the ability to insert a custom header into suspicious requests, but otherwise allowing to reach your workload. Customers use this custom header to tag suspicious traffic for alternative processing in their workloads, like sending to a honeypot, or not completing a fraudulent transaction without notifying the bot that it was detected. Diving deeper into this potential use cases of the new integrated solution, we are introducing two distinct flows. You can configure Cloud Armor security policies in several ways to leverage this integration. First, with the redirect to reCAPTCHA action, you can now configure a Cloud Armor security policy to conditionally serve the reCAPTCHA challenge forcing suspicious end users to solve the puzzle before being allowed through. Additionally, you can leverage reCAPTCHA v3 for frictionless headless bot detection by instrumenting your client side applications with a reCAPTCHA library for silent and accurate bot assessments. You can then configure a rule within your Cloud Armor policy to decipher and enforce the reCAPTCHA assessment all at the edge. Both of these operating models are deployed and enforced far upstream of applications without requiring server-side changes to ease deployment and accelerate your ability to protect yourself. 
Finally, both of these use cases can be combined in line to provide what we call the redemption flow, which gives a suspicious client the opportunity to redeem themselves before being blocked by Cloud Armor. In this case, a single Cloud Armor rule is created that first checks whether the silent recapture assessment has determined that the incoming request is coming from a malicious bot. If not, the request is allowed through. If, however, recapture's determination is that the client is suspicious or of high risk of being a bot, then the client is given the opportunity at redemption by being redirected to the recapture puzzle. The end user can solve the manual puzzle to be permitted through the Cloud Armor security policy and allowed to reach the protected applications. This is a highly anticipated use case that many enterprises have requested to ensure that human clients aren't unnecessarily blocked from accessing the application while filtering out bot traffic. With that, I'm going to hand it off to Moe's, who will tell us about ATB Financial's philosophy on protecting their assets and how they deployed WAP, including Cloud Armor Bot Management, to meet their security and compliance needs. Thank you, Neil. I'm going to talk about a brief overview of ATB Financial, then move on to ATB cybersecurity journey in the cloud, and finally summarize with a few takeaways that may be useful to you as embarking on the similar activities. I will start with a brief history of the ATB Financial. ATB is a Canadian financial services institution who has been in business for over 80 years. In the time, they have grown and changed from one small treasury branch to become the largest Alberta-based financial institutions. Its assets have more than $55 billion. At ATB, technology is unequivocally a strategic partner enabler. It underpins and fuels our client-centric products and services. But we also have a broader responsibility and role to play across Alberta. We are going to help build the technology skills that Alberta wants and needs for a diverse and future-ready workforce. As part of our client-centric attitude and mandate to transform banking, ATB has launched both transformative initiatives powered by Google. Our purpose is that we exist to make it possible, that is to support the lives and livelihoods of our clients. On the strength of this partnership, Google remains a key player in enabling our future technology strategy. Our vision is the cloud is ATB's secure, reliable, and cost-effective platform for critical high-value applications and workloads. As an example, at ATB, all GCP application development is containerized and running in Google Kubernetes engine and other cloud-native services as well. ATB's data enablement platform is centralized around Google BigQuery, augmented by Google's data services such as Dataflow, Cloud Storage, and Composer. Additionally, ATB leverages GCP to support our migration from on-premise to the cloud. Clearly, Google is a key player in enabling our future technology strategy, which is anchored in our 10-year strategy and informed by client and team member journeys. Our cloud cybersecurity strategy undertakes to proactively address both current and future cyber threats and mitigations. All of our business strategies are focused on shifting our services and service model to put our client at the center of everything we do and to take ownership of delivering truly remarkable experiences that set us apart. Specifically within the financial sector, moving to the cloud comes with the fundamental question of how effectively manage security and risk posture and alleviate many of the challenges experienced on premise. From a security strategy perspective, there are few core requirements that you would need to effectively secure and manage risk in the cloud. As we have looked at security operations in different environments, we have recognized there are some things we absolutely need. As an example, the four big ones that are essential for our teams are, as a bank, we are under constant threats from adversaries. At the same time, we must innovate to stay ahead in the business. We must also empower our teams to develop applications and APIs within a safe and secure environment and rapidly make safe, impactful code changes. We are required to have enhanced reliability and security and velocity across all cloud workloads. And finally, advanced governance and control alignment via policy as code. These requirements and needs tend to be opposite. Either you are secure or you are dynamic and agile. And if you have worked with development and security team, you know how challenging it could be to balance or achieve both with no compromises on either side. And this was a challenge for us for a while. For example, we heavily rely on innovation, which requires ephemeral infrastructure and workload. And that's because if we don't innovate, we will be bitten by our competitors. 
As a bank, we are dealing with the most incredible adversaries, the humans and bots. We are dealing with the most incredible opponent, the human being. They will innovate, they will find a way around. They have motivation, mass, scale, specialized tools and approaches. They have adversaries, uh, adversarial tactics, techniques, and common knowledge. Adversaries are always innovating to find any weakness in defenses, and we know the traditional tooling and approaches can barely keep up. What we got to do is we have to actually stop these attackers more effectively sooner, more completely with less false positives. It's all about efficiency, but efficiency and simplicity of deployment for us is how fast and easy we can embed defense solutions in our ingress paths for our web pages and our RESTful APIs. I'm going to show you how easy it is to uncover and defend trace targeting or resources using solutions powered by Google's unique threat intelligence and detect external threats, malicious activities, and unauthorized behavior targeting our assets. As I mentioned earlier, we have to actually stop these attackers in the tracks. We, we need a solution that is easy to deploy, frictionless and effective, and it has to scale. It has to be delivered as a service via infrastructure as a code. Nobody wants to be managing this security infrastructure across hundreds of projects. And it can handle both bots and humans. Okay, so we, what we did is we created a defense arsenal by orchestrated risk score token exchange between Cloud Armor and Recapture Enterprise and Apogee to create a web solution for web pages and API protection. Just like the name says, it protects our web pages and APIs from false posts, account takeovers, credential stuffing, layer seven DDoS attacks, and it provides OWASP top 10 for web pages and APIs, such as SQL injection protection and cross-site scripting. And this solution is backed by complementary intelligence and AI. We have tested this solution in our sandbox environment, and we have seen how simple and effective it is. To summarize, there are three takeaways. The web solution is a comprehensive anti-fraud solution that helps to defend business to client services from bots, frauds, and abuse. It has no complexities in implementation and operation, and its deployment can be done fully via infrastructure as a code. It is easy to embed in ingress paths and cost-effective and simple to deploy. Thank you for your time today and for allowing me to share a bit about ATB's cloud cybersecurity journey. Stay safe. Thanks, Moz. It's an honor to be able to work with you and ATB Financial to help you accomplish your application protection objectives on Google Cloud. To sum up, the need for application and fraud prevention is growing more acute in the face of increasing application complexity and an evolving threat landscape. Google Cloud's WAP solution spans DDoS, WAF, bot and fraud, as well as API protection, offering a cohesive and integrated experience, leveraging the technology, hardware, and software we developed to protect Google's own billion user properties, as well as millions of external websites. To learn more, please visit the WAP website linked here or tune into the additional breakout sessions to learn more about network security, Cloud Armor, as well as Apogee. Thank you for joining us today. Don't hesitate to reach out to learn more.